I am for peace, but they are for war. And I think that is a very common theme today. But let's think about, you know, we go back, let, let's go back and look at what Isaiah said. And he said that they shall beat their swords into plowshares and their spears into pruning hooks. And nation shall not lift up swords against nation, neither shall they learn war anymore. We're an awfully long way from that. But let's just look at a couple of things. If we look at what's happening with Israel, and we'll talk about the right-wing government that most of the people voted into office, because there's people in Israel that are for peace. And we'll not take the Palestinians, we'll just take Hamas. And Hamas is for war, the right wing of Israel is for war, and we've seen this go on and on and on and on. They're definitely not trying to live for peace. Look at Vladimir Putin. He's for war. And I think originally that... Um, if we take a look at Ukraine, it was not really 100% for peace, but it was a peaceful living nation. And we have that conflict. And we know that Putin is threatening other nations with war. He's threatening, he's threatening the whole world, the whole world with global annihilation with a nuclear war. You know, where are we? How about us human beings in general? We've made war against the animals. God gave us the commandment in Genesis 129 and 30 that both us and the animals would eat only a plant-based diet. Well, how many people in this country are plant-based? How many in this country want their pound of flesh? The most. In the world, most. So where are we? You know, I'm for peace. I know a lot of you are for peace. But the majority, the vast majority of people in this world are not. And Jesus says, blessed are the peacemakers, for they should be called children of God. Well, I guess not very many people are being called children of God, are they? Or maybe they call themselves that, but don't live it. I know a lot of people call themselves born again, but they're part of the world system. They don't even think. We need to think. Are we for peace? That's where we'll think. Ask that question. Amen?